In this ukulele tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to hold an ukulele, especially when you don't have a strap. Hi, I'm Terry. Welcome to Ukulele Pros. If you don't know about it, I have a lot of great courses and memberships up at the ukulelepros.com website. These courses have helped thousands of students improve their playing. So if you just wanna stay where you're at, make slow improvements, then keep doing what you're doing, but if you're ready to progress, ready to become the ukulele player that you know you can be, check out ukulelepros.com for those courses. One of the biggest questions I get asked is how do you hold an ukulele? Because in most of my videos, I have a strap. I like using a strap because it puts the ukulele in a nice position and it takes a lot of the pressure off my hands. But my pineapple Sundays, I don't have a strap, mainly because this beautiful koa wood here, I don't want to drill into it. So I have to learn how to play with <laughs> out a strap. So I'm going to show you some tips and tricks on how to do that. Well, if you're sitting down, the first thing you can do is you can just take this part of the ukulele and just simply rest it on your thigh here. And that will, that will kind of give it some support there. But whether it's sitting or you're holding it, the main support's gonna come right here from your forearm. And what you do is you're simply gonna just place that forearm against mainly this part of the ukulele right here. So no, it's no matter if I'm doing this or holding, holding it higher, this is where the sport is. And I'm just taking it and I'm putting it some pressure against my body. But that alone, I mean, I have to bring in this part of my wrist to hold it up. That alone won't hold the ukulele up. So this is where your left hand comes in as well, okay? But to demonstrate this, I'm gonna actually go to the next position here. So this is really the more common position that people hold the ukulele, especially if you're standing up. And so, Again, what I'm doing here is I'm just taking that forearm and I'm just pressing against the ukulele and then pressing the ukulele against my body. But that alone won't hold the ukulele up. And we don't wanna hold it here with our hand because this hand's gonna be strumming. So this is where the left hand comes in a little bit. So typically, what I've noticed is that you end up putting a little bit of the ukulele neck right here in this part of the finger, and it's just kind of resting there. And also, your thumb is a big the point of it. So notice as I'm holding this G7 chord, actually not this G7 chord, but as I'm playing, I notice the ukulele neck is, is sitting right about here in my finger, okay? So let's say I'm just gonna strum a little bit. Okay, so all that is coming from my forearm and then my hand right here. I find that strumming the ukulele without a strap isn't that bad, especially when you're here playing these open position chords. It's really not that bad. What, what gets a little more challenging is when you start either doing a little finger picking or moving up the neck a little bit, okay? First, let's do some scales. Let's say I'm gonna use my thumb here. Same thing, I've noticed that the pressure's coming from my forearm and right around here. Now let's say I move up the neck a little bit. Well now, because I don't have to support the body here, as I move up, it's a little bit easier to hold it. Plus, if I'm using my thumb, notice my fingers are right here underneath and... Okay, how about strumming some chords up higher? Okay, about the same thing, but I think it's easier as you move in up here. The biggest challenge that I've noticed without a strap is when you play finger style. I really have very little support because when I'm picking, I'm moving my hand here, which is now requiring more of my wrist to hold this ukulele. And when I'm having especially some stretches, I don't feel that great when I'm playing the finger style. So that's one thing that I've noticed that gives me trouble. Maybe if I practice it more, I would be more comfortable with it. But yeah, I don't, I don't like it, especially when you're doing more complicated pieces. So anyway, that's how you play with, without a strap. You know, I, I think it's, again, great if you're strumming. It's 
some some scales and some finger picking stuff is fine but you know it does have its limitations there are straps out there that you don't have to put any holes in your ukulele you can they wrap around and they attach to the sound hole um, but if you want to you can add the strap button here and then you could tie the ukulele up here around the neck or some people will actually put a strap button right here as well kind of more like an acoustic guitar so those are some options for you but hopefully this will help you hold the ukulele if you don't have a strap and you got some tips and tricks that will uh, make your playing a little bit better